CBT Naruto! Presented by EA Sports in association with the PGA Tour. Today it's live third round coverage of the Career Builder Challenge. Now we go down to the action at the first. Frank, it's a different feeling on the first tee on a weekend, third round of a championship like this than, say, in the first round, isn't it? You know you've got the grips of the golf course. You know the holes that are birdieable out there. More importantly, too, you know how well you're playing. It's all in front of you. Sport, especially like this at the highest level. He has given this one the full treatment. Perfect release through the ball. In this shot, he is on the fairway, over 300 yards. Uh, this looks like it's going to find the target. Good chance now for a birdie. That was an outstanding play. Well, it's almost a guarantee there after that shot. Par yesterday, now for birdie. A great start. Frank, the second hole is only 371 yards. What's the challenge here? The bunkering. This is really well bunkered. You'd expect that for a hole this short. Uh, if it's well bunkered, it means that it's vital to get it on the fairway. And that's going to stay on the fairway here at the second hole. Frank, really good chance from this position to make a birdie. Yeah, really the only thing he's looking at right now is the flag. Uh, this is a green light special. Appears to be a smart shot, Frank. Yeah, no problem here. That's going to fly all the way. Oh, can't hide the flag stick from that man. Frank going for another birdie here. Just to get on a real roll. Has it for another birdie. Two holes, two birdies. Now to the third hole, a par four, 471 yards. Frank, break this hole down for us. All the trouble appears down that left side with the series of bunkers, uh, but you've got to take into account the trees that are well, well when he goes after it like he is here. Get pitch on me. 
Come on now. What they're able to do with that Hey, Shout out to Human Torch, Superhero, Fantastic Four, Marvel, and also our girl Brie Larson as Captain Marvel. She flames all too. Three hundred plus. With the power of the cosmos. Frank, for a long time, the stadium course at PGA West was thought to be too difficult for the professionals. How'd that happen? It wasn't really unusual. A lot of Pete Dye courses, when they first came out, um, with the bulk, wooden bulkheads, so visually intimidating. It was such a departure from traditional golf design that players, they weren't very receptive to it. Uh, they thought it was too punishing. And yet now, we look some 20, 30 years later, Pete Dye's going to go down with the McKenzie's, the Donald Ross's, the CB McDonald's is one of the most innovative and uh, w one of the great architects that's actually changed the direction that the game's gone. Back in the late 1980s, the tour pros actually refused to go back to the stadium course. They signed a petition to get it removed as one of the host courses, a band that effectively ran until 2015. But now the Career Builder Challenge will return to the rotation in 2016. So Frank, what do you think of the start so far? Rock solid, um, very impressed. First par three of the day, it is the fourth here at PGA West, sitting at just under 200 yards in the card. This is a good looking shot. All right, Eagle. That was close, Yeah, let's go. Perfect execution by me. Birdie try again here today. Go ahead and do that. Birdie. Frank, this looks like a fun hole. The first par five of the day, 535 yard fifth. Yeah, as long as you've got something that doesn't go left off the tee shot and doesn't go right off the second shot, you'll be fine. This one doesn't look good. There's water over there. Wow, lucky break right there, Frank. Yeah. That's what everyone else is going to say, except him. Well, with a good shot here, Rich. Uh, this eagle on the cards, hole very reachable from where he is. Don't get many opportunities like this. This is a good place to take advantage. That is classy. Not a chance of going in. Just needs to keep it steady here over the putt. Just an amazing display. The records continue to fall. Well, here we are at the first par five of the day, the fifth, 535 yards. Frank, break it down. It's called double trouble. The uh, reason why, there's the lake on the tee shot on the left side, and then he's reversed it up there on the second shot. He put the lake on the right. No problems there. Really good approach shot. And now, good look at Purdy. That's that sneaky distance. Made a good run at birdie. He'll have to focus now. Try to walk away with the par. 14 feet to the hole. Wow, he got robbed, Frank. No, oh, it's like k kissing your mother-in-law. 
So just a formality here. Bad news is, Frank, that's a bogey, but the good news still has the lead. Can't afford another, though. Frank, the seventh is a short par four, 346 yards. So I'm guessing it's a layup off the tee, but it might be a nervy layup because you have water on the right, and if you miss left, that's no bargain. It's very distracting looking down the right side. I think that's the easiest way to put it. But if you can break this hole down, 346 yards, if you take 120 yards off that, which is like a wedge, then the layup only becomes like 220 yards. That seems a little less intimidating. Frank, it makes the game easy when you play it from the fairway. Especially when you play it from a lie like that. So a little slow out of the gates, but now Frank's starting to pick it up. Yeah, and into the ebb and flow of the game. We know you can't hit good shots all the time, so if you can just ride out the little bad patches like now, then things can still get up very quickly. See how they do on this approach. Oh, this is hitting in the wrong direction. Uh-oh. Just averted danger right there. So close. Why does he have all the luck? Birdie try again here today. Had a nice birdie on this hole yesterday. Continues to amaze yet another birdie. And what a day it's been. Now we're at the eighth hole here at PGA West in La Quinta, California. 559 yard par five. Frank, what are the options here? A good tee shot, you can certainly reach this par five and two. There's a crosswalk that comes across um, in that vicinity of 330 yards. That's sort of the, the green light area if you can get it down there. Anything short of that, it becomes uh, very much a three shotter. But if you can get it close to that crosswalk that goes there, then certainly this becomes opportunity knocks. Second shot. This is right at it. Well, he gave us a demonstration today why he's one of the best in the sport. Every green hit regulation. Settles in over the putt. That was a good run right there. Almost went in. Uh, at least he's seen the line as it went past the hole. So just replicate that on the way back. Mark a birdie on the car. Finishing out the front nine with a pretty difficult par for, again, water down that right side. I'm loving that balance. Me too. I'm loving that balance. That's just a beautiful <laughs> shot. Now the difficult second shot here at the par four ninth. This looks like it's going to find the target. Put a birdie on the card here yesterday, don't forget. Birdie here yesterday. This putt again for birdie. like to see players show some fight, Frank, and that's what we're seeing right here. That was a good birdie right there, and that uh, poor start to the round 
Seems like a long time ago. It is, just when we thought they were dead and buried. No more. Frank, this is a way to make golf easy when you can hit it that deep. Oh, I'm gonna say, I know that first number's a three. I'm guessing the second one's a two. Let's call it 320. Good chance now for a birdie. That was an outstanding play. Well, it's almost a guarantee there after that shot. This for birdie. And he has it. A good putt redeems all. Boy, this is a long par five, the 11th of PGA West. 617 yards. Great line. What a great shot. He has really hit it a long way. Second from an excellent lie. All right, Frank, time to play a little pitch and putt right now. Good chance with a good shot here to make a four. Yeah, holes like this, this is where small ball can beat big ball. This one looks like it's headed right for the middle of the dance. Floor. All right, Eagle. Rather nice shot, so. Let's get it. Let's go. That's a, that's a double eagle too. Don't forget to kiss your by me. It's how I get it done. Let's keep it moving. Let's get it. Let's go. That's my phrase by the way too. Let's get it. Let's go. That's my phrase. Let's get it. Let's go. That's my phrase. All right. Let's get it. You can lay it up just short of where that nose of the bunker starts to poke out on the right side of the fairway. Then you're going to be left with something in the sort of 140, 150 yard mark to the flag. Or if you want to get a little sort of greedy, you start to sneak it up there where it gets narrow. It's shorter. That requires a better shot. Frank, one of our colleagues at Golf Channel, Brian Hammonds, always liked to say, keep it in the short grass. It is nice to play from the fairway. The game's so much easier from the fairway. Uh, less decisions to be made. You don't have to worry about a flyer or the lip in front of the bunker or a tree. The game almost appears straightforward from there. Terrific golf shot. And now, that for an easy birdie. Birdie here yesterday, trying to do it again today. And he has it for birdie. Frank, this is no easy shot here at the par 313th. Yeah, 13th hole. I mean, it's so appropriate, the number of the hole for this uh, this design by Pete Dye. Wooden bulkheads, I mean, they give you sort of that, that harsh look. And this is just an absolute scorecard wrecker. You get a little cavalier here, you just rack up a number. There's nothing wrong with just hitting it to the right side of this green, just taking the three. Really in control of this hole. Birdie yesterday and another opportunity on the way. Getting set now over the putt. Yeah. 
Hard crack. It's only 389 yards, but Frank, where could a player go off course, so to speak, at this 14th? Well, this is a hole where you have to play your own game. Um, if you're a longer hitter, I think you can challenge that bunker and knock it over there. And if you're shorter, shorter player, you should be only looking at that left side. Um, you're always going to feel like you've left something out there on a hole like this. You always think you could have done the other option. But, but this is where you've got to stick to what you think is your game plan. Frank, really good chance from this position to make a birdie. Yeah, really, the only thing he's looking at right now is the flag. Uh, this is a green light special. Should be safely on deck. That is classy. Yeah, they have a chance of going in. Now this for birdie came away with par the previous round. All right, crowd, y'all ready to get hype? One, two, three. Let's get it, let's go. Oh, yeah. Just an amazing display. The records continue to fall. Solid par four here. The 15th is 468 yards. Well, when he goes after it like he is here. Get me down again. Flannel. This one. Oh, <laughs> Shot the human torch. Superhero versus the four. <laughs> and well, awesome. Fuck her, we lost this Captain Marvel. He's playing his own top. Treatment. Perfectly leaked the ball. That's a rat. Shot. He is on the fairway, over 300 yards. Appears to be a smart shot, Frank. Yeah, no problem here. That's going to fly all the way. Had a birdie here yesterday in their close. Great opportunity for another one. Trying to make yet another birdie. Get hype, crying. Yeah. Drops for a birdie. Now to the par 5 16. Frank, this is a pretty solid hole. Like all the other par 5s here, length gets a big advantage here. This hole, as you mentioned, bends to the left. And that bunker can be taken out of play by the longest hit. It's 326 yards will get you past that. Otherwise, it's a big shoot down the right side that everybody else has to respect. Well, hang on! <laughs> Shot the human torch and my girl we lost in this Captain Marvel. She flames on also outstanding tee shot. Put the power yeah, of the cosmos. Up. You don't have to worry about the wind or anything there. You just take a full blooded cut at the second shot from here. And a chance for Eagle after that. Yeah, I cried. Yeah, I. Oh, God. <laughs> Locked in on the 
and speed. Second par five at PGA West of 600 or more yards. The 16th is a pretty good test. the flag stick from that man Could really use this one it's for birdie you love to watch him disappear don't you well Frank hopefully the player has arrived here at 18 in a pretty good frame of mind if not you have to be thinking oh here we go again water left I mean you you could shoot a hundred out here on this golf course if you don't have your best stuff yeah this is a, another example of um, you, you're right if you've got the bad mojo going this is not the hole you want to be playing water left bunkers right um, somewhere in between though this fairway Frank, this is a position where a player is absolutely licking his chops here. Good chance to make a birdie. Yeah, this is when this game just looks like fun. Bunkers don't seem to be in play. The only thing you're really looking at right now is just the flag. Wow, Frank, he is dialed in. Yeah, that was just some shot on that. Easy birdie. And this will be a five-foot putt here. Frank, this is a player in full flight right now. It looks too easy right now. And that wraps up the third round. Just one more to go before we crown our champion. Yeah, I'm not saying I'm looking at my crystal ball, Rich, but uh, that champion that we see tomorrow might be the one just sitting at the leaderboard uh, on top of it right now. All right, CBT Naruto, over and out. And also today's ever 10, 2020 shots to the Final Fantasy 7 Remake video game coming out to die. It's amazing, exciting, pretty fresh. Shout out to Cloud, Tifa, Barrett, and the whole crew. And that's Sean's character, Bad 033, you know, we're both from the for house. And my character is Storm for Ken Hearts 3, let's get him on Switch Map Ultimate, by the way. And with all that being said, I just want to acknowledge all of that and CBT Naruto over and out.